Titanic Sinclair, Poppy's director. We'll be talking about the strange mechanics. I like to communicate with people on the internet. So many people don't understand. And how it almost has a surreal drawl that keeps you coming back time after time. Titanic Sinclair first started picking up viral popularity when he released the song on that poppy's channel, Low Life. He has also worked with several other artists. He first burst on the scene in 2007 with GroceryBag.tv. That was the username for their YouTube channel where they released crazy videos and music that you have grown to love. Welcome to my computer show. I fucked up. But to understand Poppy, to understand Mars Argo, you need to understand Titanic Sinclair. Titanic Sinclair, his real name is Corey Mixter. He's originally from Signal, Michigan. I heard he spent some time in Chicago, and right now he resides in LA. And ladies, he's a 30-year-old Aquarius. He is so deeply entrenched with the conspiracy theories behind that Poppy, Mars Argo and the infamous 336. But before he was in the Illuminati. 91, 91. Wow, what have you been up to? He spent the majority of his younger years learning brand new skills that would later develop some of the biggest projects that you know and love today. Aw, I love Mr. Clean. I love Mr. Clean. Just add water and scrub. He'd always been a fan of the Uncanny Valley concept. You've probably never heard of that, so let me explain. Do you remember those old sci-fi movies? You would watch them and you would see unhuman beings like androids or things from the future and they would talk with this kind of like delayed vocal effect. It gives us a really weird feeling, a little tingle on the back of our neck because you can tell that it's human-like, but there's just something that's off about it. Nature, Will Robinson, nature. It literally breaks the walls of our brain down. We cannot concept it. It's very intriguing. It's almost like hypnotism. Actually, it's closer to hypnotism than you think. I noticed, I, I have to ask you about the sounds in your videos. It, anytime that there is something that is very human-like, but not quite human enough to trick us into believing that it's an actual I, I feel like with the audio thing, um, that is just an extension of this kind of idea of the uncanny valley. Like, it's really kind of a hypnotism, blur the lines of reality a little bit. It can really disorient the viewer. Do you ever catch yourself really craving a poppy video? Well, if you do, you're not alone. That feeling that you're getting is no accident, and it is due to the Uncanny Valley concept. It's kind of like when you watch a vlog, you really just, uh, you're very interested into the people, but after so long, after you learn everything about them, you sort of lose interest, and then that's it. But not with Poppy videos, because it seems like she's human, and we just can't quite put our finger on it, it gives us a surreal feeling where we have questions that we have to ask. Those questions keep us coming back time and time again. Unlike vlogs where you figure out the families after so long, we just can't put her finger on Poppy. Okay, what is this? But it's not just our vocals. The expert in millennial marketing, Titanic Sinclair, has it down to a science. The movements of Poppy, the words that she says, the words that she repeats over and over again. Delete your Facebook. Delete your Facebook. Delete your... Are all strategically placed as a hypnotic vibe that gets deeply into our brains to make us crave more. We have all fallen under an illuminotic hypnotic illusion he understood the fact that people want to see what they want to see every day if you get the viewers to ask questions they will continuously be curious so titanic sinclair has beautifully installed this art into the very brains of the viewers but we don't mind it in fact we would like more of it he even goes as far as to declare that poppy is an android which most of us would believe since we have fallen so deep under the illusion how much do you look forward to seeing androids? I already know one. <laughs> who is who is this android? Poppy. I haven't seen and that the fun part about it is presenting her to the world in a way that is um done with a bit of a artistic, you know, almost in that that Warhol thing we were talking about. It's fun watching people figure it out. If you want to hear the full interview with Titan and Sinclair, I'm going to go ahead and drop that in the description below. I'm just going to leave it with the fact that Poppy, 
Titanic Sinclair, Mars Argo, the conspiracies of the Illuminati and the 336 is seriously one of the best things that have hit the internet in the last 10 years. This video's purpose was to tell you more about Titanic Sinclair, the director of that poppy. So if you want to know more, I'm going to drop my Twitter, Twitter in the description below. I want you to ask the questions that you want to know. Also, leave your creative or interesting responses in the comment box below. Thumbs up for those likes. And as always, brothers and sisters, I will see you in the next video.